Whoa, that sky looks scary. We're just getting our morning steps together, which is actually looks so nice. Know, really We're always sweet. usually like overlap because Cassie's work, but it's Cassie's morning off, so we get to enjoy the steps together and the bloody lovely weather. Um, I don't think it'll rain, it's kind of just yeah, maybe tomorrow. a little bit humid as well and a little bit gross, but that's all right. Um, bit of a prep update, we're six and a half. I know. Six and a half weeks out, which is just freaking wild, but so good. yeah, exciting. Keen to get up there and just <laughs> get it done and be able to eat. What are you most looking forward to? After? Yeah. Just to go out on a, like, dates with Date friends. Date night. Yeah. Like, yep, sushi. Yep. Yeah, keen for a meal out. We haven't eaten out since, like, October. I don't think we've ever been for a meal out, me and you. No, our last meal together was that at Italian. Oh, true. In like so. October, so long ago. So I Cassie and I need a little girls' date night. We're we're so close. We're on the home stretch, and we can definitely feel we're on the home stretch. Hey, yeah, like it's super close. It's getting a little bit difficult, but that's alright. That's what you signed up for, you know. You just like learn and grow from the challenges. But yeah, sleep last night was yeah. the first Wish night. I, <laughs> I was like. Oof, here we go. This is like gonna be six weeks of <laughs> pain. <laughs> but I just had my greens this morning. I usually would take like a little coffee on my walk, but I can tell it's gonna be a uh, a multiple coffee day. So I didn't want to get it started at like 7 a.m. with a cough, but I have my greens and I find that really just helps with digestion, bloating, immunity, even like Cassie and Jazz, my other housemate, were feeling a little bit sick like last week and I feel like it didn't really get to me and I don't know I feel like this just helps with immunity overall mm -hmm. but also just taste tastes so, so good. good like the guava flavor at the moment is going for me it doesn't taste like dirt I kind of just like the routine yeah. of having it every morning so that's from Elite Sups and it's the EHP Oxy Greens highly recommend these ash is code <laughs> code <laughs> is active ash all from Elite Sups and it works so well just ordering everything from Elite Subs because I use a whole bunch from them. So definitely recommend ordering the greens and giving that a go. I'll show you around a Thursday student, student life and gym life. <laughs> I actually feel like the reason that I come into Coles basically every second day is because the lettuce, it always goes bad so fast. But I love this baby oak leaf one. 20th of March, that isn't too bad. We get a bag of cassie as well. And then some spinach too. So really just coming in for a few extra top ups and stuff today. Um, just like some extra eggs, got some lettuce just so it goes off, um, some bagels, and then I'm just going to go to Kmart really quickly as well, but love coming at 8 o'clock like as soon as the shop's open because everything is so stocked. The amount of Chobani I go through is an actual joke. I used to actually try to do a majority of my fruit and veg shopping at Aldi because I find that it's so much cheaper there so much cheaper and they also do like a really big top of the Chobani yogurt and I'm like Coles I feel like the stuff goes off really quick but let me know if you're a Coles Woolies out kind of person. You just can't come into Kmart and not get distracted but like look how cute that bowl is. Tempted. I need a new tripod and I can't decide between that one or that one. So that one's just got the legs that come out in a three. So it's going to take up like a bit more space on the ground. Or that one's just the one stick. I don't really need the Bluetooth thing. Like I'm not going to use that, but it's just such a hard choice. So you would have seen that I ended up getting a new tripod from Kmart. Basically, this is my old tripod. And I was having some issues and it's just a little bit obnoxious to take to the gym with the whole ring light. Like I don't really need it. So we're gonna give this a go. I usually just prop my phone on um, some like equipment or the floor next to me with my water bottle at the gym. But I reckon I can I can take in a tripod now. I've been on the Instagram grind long enough that I think people know that I'm filming all the time. So why not just make it crazy obvious? But this actually looks quite compact. Just I mean 
quite big as well. Oh no, that's good. Oh yeah, well I'm excited for this. We'll test it out and see how it goes with filming my breakfast. the tripod though but I just gotta remember to click record for the whole thing but this is the final product the cream of rice I absolutely love having this with protein before I work out I feel like it gives me a whole lot of energy and it sits really well in my stomach and something else that helps sit really well with me is this almond protein from Macromike water also really sucks and I just feel like this one just digests so well and it doesn't taste like a vegan protein I'm not vegan but I do find that this one just sits really well with me, whereas some of the proteins can make me feel a little bit funky. Um, but the flavors are unreal as well. So I love the chalk honeycomb, the vanilla buttercream, and the white chocolate are probably my favorite. Um, but yeah, the texture is so amazing and it goes like so well with the chocolate cream of rice as well. Um, I'm gonna enjoy this and I probably let it digest for like 45 minutes and then I will head off to the gym. So something else about this protein too that's also amazing is you can see the benefits here. So gluten-free, dairy-free, vegan-friendly, gut-friendly, and macro-friendly. So there's about 24 grams of protein in a 40-gram serving. I usually only use about 25 grams in a serving because I can hit my protein in other ways throughout the day. Um, but it's such a good way to be able to boost up your protein throughout the day if you um, find it challenging to hit your protein or you just want your breakfast oats or cream of rice or smoothies or pancakes to taste really yummy. And the next part, part of my routine is actually choosing what pre's I want to take with me. So I love the Ghost products a lot. So this is their pump and that's like a caffeine free. It kind of just gives you that pump feeling so you can see um, all your muscles start to swell up and it gives you that fullness look that sort of gives you like more motivation during a session I guess and they just taste really really good and then I also always pick one of their legend pre-workouts so this actually is caffeinated one has 250 milligrams of caffeine in it and then it also has beta alanine which sometimes can make some people get that like itchy tingly feeling I really like it and I think I've become a little bit um like a build up a tolerance to it I don't really feel it when I um, have that anymore but they're 250 milligram serving that's for two scoops so 17 grams so you could even just take the one if you're finding that it's a little bit um too strong but the best part is just because they've got so many flavors and you can mix like the legend pre with the pump you pretty much have like endless supply of flavors so my other favorites are the red frog blue raspberry um i do have the grape one as well and I'm yet to try some of the other ones, but um, they're so good. Highly recommend. Just gets you in the mood for the workout. And um, yeah, I need the caffeine for my workout. I need the energy. Alright, I bought in my whole shop, but so for free, I ended up going with the Cyber Warmer Legend. It's with the pineapple. Oh, this is such a good combo. Um, and then the other one that I got some lateral raises, flat pull down. Um, a 
do this mixed with maltodextrin, which is like a calm powder. You couldn't get any other carbs. I used to have like the calm powder. This would taste like shit, so I used to mix it with this. And honestly, this just is like a really nice tasting cordial, even. It's so good. I also find that when I don't have it, I have like a little bit more dance after my workout, so I actually think it's pretty beneficial in like definitely helping me with fatigue as well. And I'll have one of these during my cardio days, or I'll have them in my cardio to keep me nice and hydrated. And this is the mandarin flavor, but my absolute favorite is the pineapple one or the peach rings, like the peach ring lollies. Again, super sweet. So this is the mandarin, so it's a little bit more free. The lights taste exactly like mandarin. I don't know how they do it. But yeah, I have the pump and the legend during my warm up. And then this, I'll just sip on throughout my workout. So let's get up. The whipped peanut butter and then go run to uni for the rest of the afternoon. So I've just rocked up at uni. It is almost two o'clock, so I'm pretty much just on time. I think I'll be here till like six or six thirty. I've got my macro mac protein shake in here with some ice, but. I'm actually going to um, treat myself to an espresso from the cafe and then pour the espresso in there so I can have like a nice iced coffee to sip on while I'm studying. Um, and yeah, it's just, uh, I'll show you the weather. Like on the drive over here, it was sprinkling and I do have an umbrella in the car, but I don't want to carry it around uni because I don't know, I feel like a little bit of a loser, especially if it's not raining and I'm just like carrying around this huge brolly. So I'm going to risk it. And I could potentially get very, very wet and rained on, but we'll go with that. <laughs> Day made. I actually didn't realize how um, awkward it is trying to do vlogs at uni. Like, there's a lot of people around. I'm gonna um, go to the new library. I'm quite excited. Dinner, Cassie. Oh no, it looks good. Take a look. Look at that beautiful bowl of goodness. That is a pretty big bowl as well. That doesn't really do it justice, but I'm so so excited for that. It's just um, protein pasta, chicken, tomatoes, paprika, olive oil, uh, chobani, and tomato paste to make like the creamy sauce. Mm -hmm.
Yeah. Now before bed, this is just my ritual. I have a scoop of the adrenal switch and I just mix it with water. It's so chocolatey, even with just water, and it's the perfect way to end your night. I feel that this signifies to my body, you know, like it's time for bed, food is done. This is like my little sweet treat at the end of the night on prep. And I love this one because you can get some other sugar-free, like hot chocolate options, but this one's sweetened with stevia, which really works well on my stomach. And it's got added magnesium, zinc, and ashwagandha in it, which all really help with your sleep. So, oh my gosh, I have to say like, like, and subscribe. And that is the end of my YouTube, my very first YouTube video, which is pretty exciting. So I hope you enjoyed. You can do a little like with a thumbs up and subscribe so you can see my next one. So thank you for following along with my day and I'll see you soon. Bye.